passionate. I work hard to win it, pop it in on accident. Yeah, I'm always on go, better watch your Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today is clearly bring your kids to work day. Um, I have my two babies in here, Gigi and China. You'll hear them kind of jingling around, I guess. Um, and then I have my four babies downstairs and upstairs. Um, my nephew, my cousin, my siblings are here. So my brother, sister, nephew, and cousin are here. Um, so I got water kids, okay? Um, but anywho, welcome back to the channel. You're going to be seeing two ASOP videos this week. Just a heads up because this video was supposed to come last week and it did not because, like I said, um, I have family here and it's just, you know, a little bit much, okay? But, um, yeah, you are seeing this video today, which I'm really excited about. It's probably going to be short and sweet. And then I also have a cleaning video that you'll see a living room clean with me video coming up today. Um on Instagram and on YouTube and then I have another one setting up uh this area in my studio so the other side of the studio so I actually have to do the video um edit it setting up the backdrop which you'll see that too but anywho that will definitely be coming probably this week it's not gonna take much like it's literally just a speed through of me putting up the curtains and the tree and doing a voiceover so that doesn't take much work but as you can see i am standing here in a bikini of course this is from asof and um i do have a coupon code asof which is d dash white 25 it'll be down below i'm really looking to see if i like this camera angle um I think I do it's okay it's just showing too much of like my wax and setup over there but um yeah I'll fix it if I see it needs to be fixed uh I don't think I have much housekeeping on my head is the Nivea unit from thrifty slay it's a closure unit on my lashes on my lash line is just another thrifty slay pair from the uh diva lash book and yeah that's pretty much all the housekeeping i did a whole like mental health check-in last week and people was like oh i'm here for the haul and i'm like and i'm here to do my mental health check-in like girl you can skip forward if you don't want to see it i'm sorry y'all don't care about people y'all just want to see club not y'all but just the people who was commenting and liking that comment like dang can i not check in honey fast forward for the clothing but anywho i'm gonna do one just because that just pissed me off a little bit mentally i feel great um i had a few meetings last week which were great news and great opportunities and i'm gonna take them and i'm stepping outside of my comfort zone um i had to sign an nda so i can't tell you guys exactly what it is but i'm super excited about it um the collection went really well and i'm super excited about that as well so let's go ahead and hop into the clothes um y'all know the descriptions will be on the screen sizes from asof is usually a 3x so yes um this first thing here you see the camera kind of dimmed down a bit but this first thing here is just this red bikini um it's a three-piece set which i have the skirt over here which i keep kind of flinging around um what i like about this is the top is stringy but one thing um i do like that you can kind of adjust it has you can stretch it out a little bit underneath the boobs and then i still feel like it's gonna fall <laughs> through it a little bit um and you can tie it and make it tighter like that with the strings and then you can also tie it around the neck portion usually when i see stuff like this it's thongs um it doesn't have any back coverage so um yeah i don't really know about this one like the whole back is out but i do like that the actual panty does have coverage because sometimes it just be like straight thong now i'm trying to see how this actually goes because i'm not too sure but i'm gonna just step into it and hopefully it go like it but yeah you have this little cover up piece which i thought was super cute but it's funny because the bottom actually has fuller coverage than most but look how cute that is super duper cute and i was so pissed because i can't find my camera remote i mean it's not connected to my phone i'm just like oh this is really cute okay your back is still out <laughs> but it's cute I like this so you know I actually used to be like how do people I 
I just automatically assume, not that all plus size people were like shaped alike, but like, how you ain't got no rose? You know, I used to be like, how you ain't got no rose? How you, how you ain't got no cellulite? But that's just like comparison and comparison is what the thief of joy. So um, honestly, once I got out of that and got older and kind of started finding my own way, it was just like, girl, all bodies are different. Uh, airbrush is real you know people be airbrushing and smoothing and things like that so you know it doesn't comparison is just unnecessary you know um, you have to love what you are working with and if you don't love it and you can change it or want to change it and feel like if you do change it you'll love yourself then you may need to do that if you choose to but um, y'all know I'm a firm believer in loving yourself at every stage okay this body is a gift all right so treat it kindly and it might sound cliche and stuff but i mean like you can be here today and gone tomorrow and i wouldn't want to be here today hating myself okay so i'm gonna love myself every step of the way and i do so i want y'all to get that too okay so i got it oh this is so pretty <laughs> i got it kind of where i wanted it to be and i love that you <laughs> whatever <laughs> i'm looking at the floor and stuff because the white floor or the blanket that i have as the flooring was kind of visible before but now i think we're good we're great so um we have this neon like mesh dress me i would probably use it as a cover-up i'm sure some girls can do like something really cool with like maybe a tube mini green bodycon and kind of have that or two-piece uh mini set and wear that underneath as like an outfit um you know but i think this is more so like a swim cover up for me i will say the bottom of this was like kind of tough getting into it because it has like stretch but not really like it's meshy stretch but at the end i don't know if they were trying to like have a certain shape but it was kind of like oh this is like stretch out a little bit but yeah um once it's on it's definitely cute i want the light to kind of go down a bit so um yeah you can see the true color but it's definitely as neon but just a little bit darker in a sense but yeah this is the back here again i would use this as a swim suit cover up and i think the light and dim down yes perfect so this is what it looks like in person it's actually this bright and this vibrant um i would definitely do a white or green swimsuit underneath here i look like a highlighter <laughs> this is definitely beach mode Khadija just came back from miami and i'm just like girl she had such a good time um but you know um actually really randomly let me know comment down below um if your state is now taking precautions against c19 and i'm saying c19 y'all should know what i mean by that because you two be tripping okay but um comment if your state has um brought any mandates back uh we are now in north carolina uh, my girlfriend actually texted me before this video and said we're in a state of emergency and you know masks are being required again and i think you know we are probably going to be shut down again so um comment down below if your state is taking precautions or not and if you are taking precautions or not so yeah that'll be our question for this week all right i don't know how many times i requested this dress i saw it maybe two three weeks ago um when it had first got on the site and i was like oh my gosh i want it now it's actually more neon in person and what's funny is you can actually see the true color over in that mirror that's like the color it is in person it's so um bold kind of edgy real sexy i feel like a ig model <laughs> in this like with the cutouts and just the top of it and if you that risque type and you want to pull it all the way down like that you can definitely do that i can see that being done for an image or whatever the case is but i absolutely love this um i didn't think that the top would do much for me i thought it would kind of be all over the place but it actually is not and i am pleasantly surprised there so yeah um it's not super supportive but it definitely has a little has a little bit of hold 
um me personally i usually have to tie these straps here to kind of give it a little more lift um so that's the only thing i did wish this would have and that would be adjustable straps now usually i don't like um back slits but because of the type of dress this is i think it actually works out um it is like cut off in the back but this kind of has nice coverage so it's not too it's skimpy a little bit <laughs> but it's not too too skimpy to the point where it's like Ugh, i can't wear that it's just not it um i wouldn't even wear an mk bra with this i would probably just go ahead tie these straps and um wear it as is because i don't feel like the girls look bad in this um i'm trying to see kind of where this is supposed to be or where it like naturally falls because it kind of lifts it up and do like a curvature like that but anywho um that is this dress here a nice neon pinkish coral color um and i like the length of it as well where it comes all the way to my ankles i am 5'4 um i leave my measurements on my site but yeah look at it this is the true color it's so freaking cute okay so i actually think this could be a really good bridesmaid dress so when i think about my wedding um i want it to be a little uh non-traditional and um you'll kind of i don't want to do it like you know tell my ideas and stuff right now but um anywho the point of the matter is i think this is a cool bridesmaid dress and i think it'll work for um a lot of people like to make sure everyone in their bridal party that the you know the gowns are flattering and i think this is good i do think it would look a little bit better kind of taking it being what in the world <laughs> being taken in a little bit at the waist um because it is kind of loose in that area and kind of just falls and i'll show you that when i come up close i just wanted to show you the length of this which is actually pretty long on me um i would step on it unless i had on heels but yeah um if i come up close you'll kind of see how the waist is not really where the waist my waist naturally sits so it would definitely need to be pulled up and taken in just a little bit like that so that's what i was trying to say there <laughs> but um i do thank my sister because i was in her bridal party and we actually had gowns similar to this style but it was in lavender so my brother and my sister-in-law and she was like you know i want to make sure everybody feels really good in their gowns um and i also like the non-traditional where women um in a bridal party actually wear different dresses of the same color i think that's pretty cool too because you kind of have a choice of, of what you want you know to look like in your dress but um i know we're just going on a wedding tangent but this is actually a really cute maxi um it's definitely given formal it's definitely given um you can wear this to a elegant event again a bridesmaid if you want to and if you're just a guest you can also wear it as well so i think this dress has a lot of potential like i said personally i just would want it taken in a little bit in the waist because it seems to kind of fall down just a little bit this is the back here it does button at the neck and then it has like this opening here which i think is actually really really sexy so that is this maxi dress here halter button at the neck um nice stretchy material easy to get into i stepped right into it and tied or buttoned it at the neck and that was pretty much it um like i said the only thing i would change is the waist on myself all right so here we have this short set and um i want to say it may have been listed as like moderate stretch and i absolutely get that <laughs> absolutely get it it actually has this elastic band inside which kind of peeks through a little bit but luckily it's a black elastic band so it's not too obvious but um i love this it's like a poof sleeve it's giving me baby doll vibes for some reason and i'm sorry i'm just trying to tuck in the elastic band but i do think this actually feels really good on it fits really nicely um i didn't know how it would look on me um simply because i didn't know the material but it's like a thick um i call it a crepey material i don't know if it'll pop up but you know this is what it looks like up close it's just a really thick stretch so here we have the back 
the back actually does get a little short on me however i have been um i used to be really and i always mention this self-conscious about the marks on the back of my thigh so like right here in the center um from wearing pants in high school my uniform pants kind of cut right there and they were my favorite but they did cut right there and it kind of left a permanent indenture you know you have to wear a uniform every day those pants were being worn monday wednesday friday <laughs> so yeah um i used to be really self-conscious about those and just in a front too like little but now i'm just like i'm starting to like rompers i'm starting to like shorts okay um and i think this is a really cute short set i do feel like you can definitely wear some fishnets and some doc martens or you can wear some heels some thigh boots whatever the case may be um i definitely wouldn't wear this with sneakers like i said maybe the doc martens or the boots um or a heel or a booty or something but definitely wouldn't dress this down i feel like it's a little too dressy with the poof sleeve and stuff um to be like sneaker mode but all right yeah. so i still have on those same shorts but i wanted to show you this like tube top and that really bothers me because i see the elastic so i know y'all see it but anyways <laughs> um i just want to try on this tube top it is ribbed it's actually i wouldn't say super supportive and i feel like i've said that multiple times today where i feel like it's not the most supportive but you actually have a little support in these like tops in this haul okay um it does have rugen on both sides and i think that is actually really really cute that you can adjust it they are functional um you can pull it up a little bit if you want to make it more like that okay or you can definitely pull it down and let out some of the rouge but i think this is really cute i love the color um i love the color of my skin tone as well uh, i think this is super super simple but it gets you know you have the point the point is simple but cute um you can wear this with a pair of jeans and heels jeans and sandals shorts sandals you know it actually looks pretty good with these shorts here so i um, can definitely do this a lot of ways lately i love wearing my bandos wide leg pants walking around the house so that's probably what i do with this today put this on with a pair of navy um wide leg flare pants walk around play with my siblings and stuff we played a call of duty played the grand theft auto gauntlet all of that so we just play the game watch movies i cook dinner i've been cooking y'all cooking okay but yeah um i think this is cute simple effective can be dressed up or dressed down and this is the material ribbed mauvey real comfortable and soft okay so this is the same material as the black set so um like a thicker crepey material um but yeah anywho absolutely love this okay it's a wide leg pant set uh, it had potential on the website um and i was like hmm i want to have it a look it actually looks so freaking good look at the pink look at it it's so cute um and it actually is a little bit deeper darker in person um probably what you're seeing right now it's closest to that but i think this is so cute so comfortable uh if i stand straight up this is what it looks like now i was confused oh let me show you the back i was confused it just fits so good like i don't feel it feels like no fuss so with this i would definitely go in with a bra um i don't know if i would do strapless or a uh, strap what i about to say strap on strapless or with straps okay um but i'm also kind of confused because the sleeves kind of look like they want to sit on my arms but then it also feels like it kind of wants to be off the shoulder so i'm not really sure but i do love that wide sleeve there i think that is cute i'm trying to see how i would want to wear it and i honestly would probably wear it just off the shoulder like this and then just do like a strapless bra do a slight fold under and this will be my vibe so i think this is gorgeous look at that super cute silhouette um i think that is really really gorgeous this pink oh it has pockets as well i didn't mention that but um i just think this is really really pretty it's a stunning piece it's a stunning set 
um if they have another color i want it but i'm just trying to see where i would wear it because it's a it's many things you can do and um i was telling my girlfriend i was like i'm not the type where if i'm going to somebody else's occasion i'll wear black and i wouldn't do a color because i don't want to do too much you know it's their occasion like a birthday dinner or whatever so i do see this being worn to like a brunch or dinner but i will also you know it would have to be just all of us getting together a bunch of girls guys whatever getting together and not just me going to celebrate someone else if that makes sense because i want them to wear the pink or be the spotlight okay and everybody else wear like you know jeans or black or you know be cute but you you know and I know that is a great debate. I know I'm going on and on. I know that's a great debate. Like, everybody should be able to be stunning and standing out. Honey, I feel like everybody looks amazing in black. But if everybody at the table got black and then the spotlight, the guest of honor, has on like a yellow, a red, a pink, a blue, it looks so beautiful. <laughs> it looks so beautiful. But if we all just going out and getting up, everybody show out, okay? That's when you all wear the colors. Anywho, let me go ahead and get into the last set because I've been rambling in this video about weddings, about kids, about all types okay. of ish. So here is the last set. It's definitely more so a lounge pajama type set. Also rib, just like that tube top. Really, really lightweight. Um, you can definitely do like a little tie or whatever if you want to be more sexy at home or whatever the case may be. However, I have seen where loungewear and PJs have been like styled into like outfits and stuff. Um, the tag on here says 2X, but I believe I may have gotten it in a 3X. I have to check the site and check my order or whatever, but um, this is how the shirt comes full length like that. Um, you guys know this is not, <laughs> not my vibe, but the back i feel like my booty cheeks is out a little bit so yeah but the shorts come up nicely but the bottom is just like kind of hanging out a little bit just a little bit just a little bit so this is definitely around the house wear for me but it's really really comfy and cozy i don't feel like any digging or anything um i would definitely just do it just like this braless chilling lounging around but yeah, that was my ASOP haul. Sleeves are nice too on this here. But that was my ASOP haul for this week. I love how the V is done. What in the world, Nat? Dang. I love how the V is done. I think it's super cute. And um, it's just cozy. It's definitely houseware, loungewear, comfy cozy is the vibe I'm getting with this. But uh, this, again, <laughs> was my ASOP haul. Every time I'm about to wrap it up, I'll find something else. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, that coupon code is D-Y25. I will see you again on Thursday, okay? Um, happy Monday. Hope you guys enjoy your week. Make it great. Also, comment down below if your state is now taking precautions once again um, with mandates and things like that. And um, kind of how you feel about it. And are you thinking we're kind of going into another lockdown? So, comment down below. Something like a little check-in. I know this has been a lot on a lot of people. Mentally, it can be draining. Physically, you can be tired of it all. Like, so I know. Okay, I get it. Comment down below. Let me know. Some feedback. Some thoughts. Uh, also, comment your favorite thing. I would definitely have to say that coral dress and that pink set I just had on were probably my favorite things uh, from this haul. But yeah, let me know your thoughts down below.